Interesting question, what was the effect of the Zeppelin on air travel? Well, let's dive into that. For anyone confused, the Zeppelin was the first commercial lighter-than-air ship. And when it first debuted, it was awesome, but it also simultaneously didn't really change all that much. Lighter-than-air devices had already been around for over a century, and they effectively had two uses. The first was to be used by the wealthy as a kind of luxury pleasure ship, with a full century of really funny developments to try and institute power and steering in these ships. And the second thing, of course, being a military tool where it could be used as either a spy vessel or a bombing vessel, depending on what you're going to use it for. Now, while Zeppelins were useful in this capacity, at least for a time, they simultaneously were not very cost efficient. It took a large amount of resources to construct something like this. And losing one in a disaster or getting shot down during war is a huge loss for a country to take. The reality of the situation was is that no matter what their purpose was, they simply weren't cost effective enough to build enough of them to matter. 